I'm just waiting for um, <clears throat> everyone to arrive for my Mindfulness in Nature course. This is week number three. And today we're going to be looking for plantain and yarrow. We're going to try it as a tea and make medicine out of it. So really get to know the plant. I'm also going to show them my hedgerow syrup, which has got rose hips, elderberries, oh, and haws off the hawthorn tree in it. Um, sugar reduced down in a windowsill and rebottled. So, uh, yeah, should be fun. So we're outside looking for plantain and yarrow. So I've got some yarrow, that's the feathery stuff there. And I've got some plantain. We've just found a good chunk of uh, yarrow. It's very easy to distinguish because it's very feathery like leaves. It's best picked in the summer, but it's winter, so we haven't got that luxury. It still will contain um, some of the properties though that we're looking for. So yeah, good find. Okay, so some of the medicinal uses of the plantain is um, mainly for coughs and colds and a decongestant. It's excellent for bee stings. It's an antihistamine, so good for nettles, any sting or bite. Wound healing, bleeding, infections, and other skin conditions. It's a mild diuretic. Yes, and sinusitis, and treat dandruff. So plantain is also good to settle the stomach. So if you've got diarrhea or indigestion or ulcers. And it's high in vitamin C, iron, and calcium. It's a bit of a wonder drug. So yarrow is the next one that we collected. It's known as a cure all herb. It really is brilliant for so many things. It's good for the circulatory system that stops bleeding and moves stagnant blood, preventing and clearing blood clots. So it's good for anyone who's got high blood pressure or low blood pressure, bringing the blood pressure to the right level. Uh, first rate a fever herb, so good for anyone who's got a fever and any hot conditions. Antibacterial and antimicrobial. Again, good for digestive system, so diarrhea, dysentery and cystitis. Remedy for thrombosis, bruises and hemorrhoids. Painful periods and menstruation. So good for uh, the hormones, so for women in general. Oh, they call it the nosebleed um, herb as well. So just plug your nose with two rolled up bits of uh, yarrow, stick them up your nose and it should stop the bleeding. Toothache, earache, so much that it does. And it's everywhere. Not so much in the garden like the plantain, but in meadows, um, along pathways, hedgerows, it's all over. So we're just chopping up the plantain now, ready to put in the pots to cover with almond oil. I'm impressed with your chopping skills. Isn't it good? Yeah. Oh, I'll do a, a bit. I'll do a bit of this. I've got onions at home that need chopping. <laughs> so here is the chopped up plantain going into the jars. So if you're interested in finding out more about medicinal properties of plants, weeds, herbs, I personally love these books. I've got the Hedgerow Medicine book. Highly recommend that. And Glenny Kindred is just awesome. She's just so connected to Mother Earth and nature and her books are brilliant. Lots of remedies in there and also just ways to connect with nature. So letting in the wild edges. So today was a really good session. It's finished now and everyone went away with their own uh, healing remedy, their um, sort of healing uh, oil. We had plantain tea and we tried yarrow tea and it was interesting. I had uh, let everyone try my plantain tincture that I made with vodka. I just put a few drops on your tongue and one woman had, she'd have really painful sinuses today and she said it eased it dramatically. So I was very happy about that. One woman drank the yarrow tea, which is like heal all herb and she had bitten her lip and it had swollen. And she says the swelling went down after drinking the tea. Just goes to show what we've got in abundance outside our back doors for free, created by Mother Nature, totally safe. Um, and it was really wonderful just 
walking about and looking for the different shapes of the leaves and being mindful while we were doing it. Yeah, it was a really, really good session, very happy. And now it's snowing very heavily outside, so I'm gonna go and enjoy that. Bye. Thank you.